the daughter of Clint Eastwood, Francesca, is happy with her boyfriend Alexander Wraith, one month after she was detained in a Beverly Hills automobile for assault. According to a source, they are a couple, they never broke up, and they are working through whatever issues they have. They are very much a normal couple with ups and downs. They are doing well and have been talking a lot. They may rely on the close-knit community surrounding them. Additionally, they are very much in love. On November 8th, they were spotted cuddling up to one another at the 39th annual Fort Lauderdale International Film Festival's Queen of the Ring premiere at Hollywood, Florida's Seminole Hard Rock Hotel and Casino. The actress, 31, put her arm around her longtime partner, with whom she shares a son. After a fight with her boyfriend in mid-October in Los Angeles, Francesca was arrested for felony domestic violence. But they appeared to be in love at the event. Wearing a brown blazer, black blouse, and blue trousers with heels, the blonde beauty, who starred in her father's film Juror 2, placed her arm around her partner. Because of the alleged attack, she made headlines last month. According to a source, Eastwood, whose mother is actress Frances Fisher, got into a verbal spat with her companion while they were driving in Beverly Hills. The actress then allegedly went physical. After that, Eastwood's boyfriend called the police, who suggested that he travel to the Beverly Hills Police Department's safety zone to speak with authorities. When Eastwood's boyfriend showed up to talk to the police, he had visible injuries. The celebrity was taken into custody and charged with felony domestic violence. Whether Wraith was the victim was unknown. Eastwood was released from detention on $50,000 bail when her partner declined medical assistance. When Francesca and Alexander made their red carpet debut in May 2018, it was said that they had been dating for some time. They had just revealed that she was expecting their first child, a son called Titan, who was born in September of that year. Alexander and his wife of eight years filed for divorce. Lily Gale drawed in June 2018 while dating Francesca. Nonetheless, he claimed that everyone is moving on and happy, and that he and Lily had been apart for three years by that time. In addition, Alex has a son from a past relationship. Jordan Feldstein, Jonah Hill's brother and Maroon 5 manager, was Eastwood's former spouse. On November 25th, eight days after their November 17th, 2013, wedding, Eastwood filed for an annulment. Feldstein passed away in December 2017 at the age of 40 due to obesity, pneumonia, and blood clots that started in his legs. Francesca has pursued a career in performing in TV shows and films, following in the footsteps of her well-known parents. Her roles in movies like Jersey Boys, Final Girl, Outlaws and Angels, MFA, The Vault, and Old have earned her the most recognition. Francesca said in August that she found it bittersweet to watch her 94-year-old father become a grandfather. There is a contrast because, after becoming a mother herself, she said that her father was extremely strict with her as a child. I mean, he's just the sweetest, she remarked. You know, when I was a child, both my parents were really strict with me, my mom and my dad. And it's so beautiful and sometimes bittersweet to just see how classic and doting grandparents are to their grandson, who is incapable of doing anything wrong, she continued. It is wonderful that her parents are so involved in their grandchild's lives, the Outlaws and Angels actress added. She wants to do everything in her power to nurture the relationship. But it's great, the beauty said. Additionally, I am clearly interested in their own relationship. They are amazing and so present. There is nothing like this bond. And fostering such relationships is undoubtedly the most significant aspect of my life at the moment. The Jersey Boys actor, who accompanied her family on the 2012 season of the E! reality show Mrs. Eastwood and Company, also said that she may not have appreciated how much her parents included her in their careers when she was a child by bringing her to film sets. She now, however, has such a regard for the amount of work that goes into making a movie. Looking back, she remarked, I don't know if I appreciated it that much at the time, but they really included me and had me visit, and they kind of dragged me around with them. Anything, filmmaking, anything acting, whether it was watching movies or sitting behind the camera, watching them direct, sitting in hair and makeup, all this stuff, was the only topic they ever discussed with me in an adult manner. Everything that goes into crafting a movie is something I greatly like and respect.